What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. All right, guys, we're going back to Sol 953. We're going to be looking at a pan. And this is pretty good. This is by Keith Laney. Let me show you the photo or the pan. Right here, you can see Curiosity Sol 953 by Keith Laney. Now, this is posted, I believe, in 2017. Yeah, right here. January 11, 2017. Now, I'm almost positive I did this particular anomaly way back. Now, uh, if not, it doesn't matter. We're going to have a new look at it today. Now, I'm just going to show you this anomaly. Two things are at play here, guys. One, manipulation. Surprise, surprise. And the fact that this may be encrusted. Now, one thing I'm going to do this time, I'm going to do differently, is sometimes, you know, maybe once in a blue moon, people will say, well, you know what? You're telling these people what you think it is, so therefore they're just being guided. This time, I'm going to do a little bit different. This time, I'm going to show you the anomaly, and I'm going to tell you to pause it. And I want you to look at this thing carefully, and then go ahead and unpause it, and then you'll hear what I have to say about it, okay? So... Let's get into this. Again, this is the whole pan. Uh, thank you very much, Keith Laney, for your work. This is much appreciated. And he uses a lot of PDS. He'd rather use the PDSs than use any other thing on here because it's usually the most clearest, right, with the most detail. All right. So let's make this whole screen. I'm going to show you this thing. Right. <laughs> this is neat. When I seen this thing, I said, there's no way this thing's natural. There's no way. So we're going to concentrate on this side with all these so-called boulders. And we're going to have a close look. We're going to zoom right in. Now, this is the bunch of rocks we're going to have a look at. Now, the object in question is right here. This is it right here. Now, if you guys want to pause it now, you can do that. But I'm also going to go into Photoshop and do the same thing. I'm going to ask you guys to pause it and have a look at it. Tell me what you think it is. I'm not going to say anything else. You know, I'm not going to say what I believe it is right at the moment. You pause it and have a close look. Now, there's other things in this area as well. You can see what looks like a block here right behind it with corners. You can see the 90 degree corners. Okay. But there's other things here, guys. Oh, my God. Things that are just like, it, it just, there's no way they're natural. Okay. You got pieces like this sticking out. Okay. This so-called rock, you can see the manipulation right here right there this thing is not natural you can see there's two identical pieces coming down okay and you can see the rest of the thing is white now what these things are we have no clue but that doesn't mean it's natural of course it, some people say it's not unnatural okay show me a rock that looks like that and we'll talk okay plenty other things here guys look at this just weird pieces sticking out let's jump into this let me just back out a little bit go ahead and do that there Let's jump right into Photoshop because this thing is neat. I'm just going to show you this thing again. All right. We're going to zoom into that. And again, you guys can pause it where you like. All right. Now, if you guys already made your decisions, I'm going to tell you what I believe it is. And then we're going to enhance the crap out of this so we can actually see the other things that are also in here. Okay. We'll jump right to the fully enhanced after this. All right. First thing I see. Now, let me just go ahead and make this, this a hair a bit smaller right there all right now what i see here appears to be mechanical let me show you what i'm talking about this piece here you can see this 90 degree angle right here okay and you've got this 90 degree angle over here to the right when you see this this appears to be rounded right here like two pieces of it and you'll see that pretty darn clearly but take note of this thing that goes like this now there's another 90 degree angle right here okay go across this seems to be just about the center. This thing, I, I contend that this piece here swings just like this into this corner here. So this thing literally, right here on this edge, this end, turns and closes into that. Have a better look at that. And you will see this a lot better. Now, there are more details in here as well, and you will see that. There appears to be something doing this with this round circle and some other little features on there. Now, let's have a look. And what we're going to do is we're going to completely enhance this thing, fully enhance, bring it way up. Now let's have a better look at this piece. Take a look at this now, guys. Tell me what you say. I see something mechanical. I see something that, like I said, again, this thing, this piece here goes into, this thing closes into this part here. So this thing is like a turntable type thing. It goes into this piece. At least that's the way it looks. Okay. 
Let me get up a little closer to this and check that out. There's too many features on here that make this thing mechanical. There's no way, at least in my opinion, that this thing is natural. Okay? Now, we'll go back to that. Let's have a look at this stuff over here. You've got this piece on this side. Now, you won't see this piece here too clearly on the original. Let's have a look. But it is, in fact, there. Let me zoom into it. Right there, you can see it just coming down. Almost looks like a point. But take note of the actual shape of this. Okay? It appears to be something that does this. Okay? Check that out. Other pieces in here. Really interesting. In the back. This object right here. What is going on there? Okay. Pretty interesting as far as I'm concerned. We have what looks like a bunch of mechanical parts right here. Look at these pieces right here. Okay. There's multiple pieces. I don't know what this could even be. But you don't see rocks doing this, guys. Look at this. Whatever that is, okay? I talked about this piece here in the beginning. Check this out. This object right here. Now, if you zoom into this, take note of this. Look at the manipulation going like this. This here seems like there's double pieces of that right there. Of course, I'm just making this sloppily, but you guys get the idea. Enhance it. Check that out. You can see this blur pretty darn well now. Okay. What is that? I have no clue. I couldn't tell you what it is. But that doesn't look natural. Okay. This object right here. Half of this, you can see it's still yellow or goldish color, because that's the part that was actually covered. Let's have a look. See it? It is, in fact, there. Once you burn the garbage away, and I could still see it without even burning it away, right there. And right there. What is that? I find it hard to believe that's natural. Okay? How about this item here? What is going on right here in this section? Enhance it. This is what we got. Now, you can see the lines are still there. I'm just docking the lines. That's all I'm doing to that. Get more defined lines. Cut through the BS, so to speak, and that's what you get. These pieces over here on this side. Look at this stuff, guys. I see a junkyard. I do not see anything that looks like rocks. Here's a perfect example. Look at more manipulation. And I swear I got people. I just had an argument with a guy when I did my moon video. They claim, oh, there's no way they could do anything to the moon uh, photos. They would not do that. I, my opinion is no. Well, your opinion means squat until you actually put some work into it and actually see this thing. But to me, that is no way. You can see it right there. It looks like it appears to be a hole at the bottom of this. Okay. And whatever this white piece is here. Okay. Not sure what to make of that. But it is there. See that? Even when we do this. It's still there. Nothing's changed. This is the original photo. I can go way, way smaller. Watch this. Let me go back to the original. And because this thing's darker and everything's a pukey same color, so on and so forth, it's harder to see. However, doesn't mean you cannot see it, right? Right up here. It's right here in the photo. Right here. This is going to be much bigger now. But you can see that right there, right in the middle. Okay. How about this piece here, guys? This is the, now this is the original photo. I'm not doing anything to this, right? Look at this rock. Oh yeah, that's natural. But look at this. How can this actually be natural? Right here. Now whether that is manipulation or an actual block or or some kind of uh, part of a structure or whatever it may be, I don't know. Either way. 
They're not telling the truth. And here it is right here. Come on, guys. And it's not like we have to prove that they're lying. I think we established that a long time ago, right? Um, but just the stuff that's in here, guys. My God. Look at this. Things that look shiny. Look at that right there. And I'll zoom into this a little bit better. Looks mechanical. No way does that look natural. Got these pieces, like these little white pieces sticking out right here. Out of this whatever object this thing is. And if you look at this thing carefully, you can see what looks like something right here. Some kind of darker object or piece there. See that right in there? And just the white pieces are sticking out. Guys, they manipulate this stuff so where it looks like it's all natural. And clearly, it's not. Look at this stuff back here. Just this object alone. I'm just going to circle around it. Look at this. What is that, guys? You got to love this stuff. You don't know what you're going to find in here. Something metallic right here. You can see the part of his hair coming down. And we get this metallic piece sitting right here. Now, take note of the manipulation. Okay? If they can hide most of this thing from you, you'll be none the wiser. Okay? All I do is brighten this thing up. That's why it looks the way it does. But let's put it real small. Zoom back in. Go back into it. And you can still see this thing shining just a little bit right here. Right there. It's got a little bit of reflection going on there, right? Okay. What is this stuff? Look at it. Here. Stuff here. Look at this object right here. It appears to be white right there. Goes like this. Not sure what to make of that. You see it actually comes down here. I actually put the line over it, but right there. What do you guys think? What are we seeing here? Something on the ground right here. And you can see where they went through this thing. Manipulation. You can see, because you can still see the object through the manipulation. That's how you know it's manipulation. You should not see through sand. You should not see through a rock. You know, look, you got something right here. This is supposed to be a rock, but check this out. There's something embedded in that rock or manipulation over the, over the object itself. Whatever it may be. Look at all the little stuff in the back around here. All of this stuff in the back. This piece right here. What are we seeing? This part right here. Almost looks reflective as well. Okay. There may actually be a second part, a short part to this. I'm going to show you something else in here that's pretty pretty wild. And guys, you may want to bounce over to Lunar Anomalies and Beyond after too, because I'm going to actually also have a moon one up as well. So uh, keep an eye out for that as well. All right, guys. I'm going to leave you with this here one last time. There you go. Tell me what you guys think. All right, guys. What are you seeing here? I showed you the object, and I told you to pause it first. And the reason for that is so you can get your own ideas before I even tell you what I believe it is. And I think that's what we should do from now on. I don't want to mislead anybody or try to get them to agree with me. I don't want to do that. I want you guys to use your own thinking and say, hey, this is what I believe it is. You may say, well, I see something totally different there. I don't see that at all, Chris. And that's fine. I, I love to hear everybody's thoughts and everything else and uh, what they're saying. But when I see this part of the photo, just part of the pan alone, I see manipulation. But I also see a lot of steel parts, stuff that's twisted, parts of machines, like that object I showed you in the very beginning. Now I see manipulation, and I see this thing may be encrusted to boot. But anyway, guys, as always, drop your comments and thoughts below. Let me know what you think. Like and share. It is always appreciated. That's how the word gets out. And speaking of sharing, guys, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. It helps get this video out. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, please subscribe. And don't forget to hit the notification bell on the right-hand side of it so that you'll be notified of the new upcoming videos. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.